luxury packaging when it comes to our brands our small businesses coming up with the final packaging for your brand can be somewhat of a headache you might be thinking have i included absolutely everything that i need to in my packaging what is classified as luxury packaging how do i even go about getting luxury packaging that is exactly what we're going to cover in this video we are going to talk luxury packaging and luxury packaging ideas for those of you that don't know me my name is teddy g and on this channel I like to take you on a journey of growing and building my clothing brand as well as trying to drop tips, tricks, gems and all of that good stuff and this video is going to be one of those gems video. So let's talk luxury packaging. Before we even dive in to packaging and packaging ideas there are two things that we need to have covered so the first thing you're going to need is your logo whether that be a text-based logo or a graphic type logo you are going to need some sort of logo ready because one thing about packaging it's gonna need to have your logo especially if you're dabbling in that luxury type packaging vibe it needs to be finished it needs to be complete with your logo on there so if you haven't produced a logo or come up with a logo for your brand you can either hop onto adobe illustrator and produce your logo that way or you can hire an expert on fiverr to start coming up with logo ideas for your clothing brand after you've got the basis of your logo the next thing you're gonna need to think about is branding and colors less branding more colors so what are your brand colors when it comes to your brand colors it can just be colors that you like but what i will say is try and stay away from like your typical like basic colors when i talk basic i'm talking about like your whites and your black having a black and white brand or white and black brand try and think outside of the box so for example my clothing brand my favorite color is navy blue so i definitely wanted to incorporate navy blue in the brand colors of my brand so the main color of my brand is navy blue but when we first started shiva shiva we used to produce these garments which had these beautiful like orange like patterns on there so when it came to finalizing my brand colors i wanted to implement orange into it as well so my final brand colors like my main colors are blue and orange so navy blue and orange i do also have elements of gray and white in there when it comes to like my website and stuff but the main colors for my brand is navy blue and orange so i'm going to show you an example my envelope that i pop like invoices in that that is navy blue the logo for my brand is in orange the ribbon that i wrap around my box is also orange so those are the sorts of things that i was thinking about when it came to utilizing the brand colors that i'd come up with for my clothing brand so when it comes to coming up with brand colors i would say focus on two main colors and then you can have an additional two that you use when you need to if that makes sense so when it comes to luxury packaging we have have to accept that a poly mailer is not luxury so we have to look at either rigid boxes like the box that i have here or corrugated boxes now both boxes are relatively like better for the environment in terms of the type of materials that are used for these boxes so it's not plastic that's what i'm trying to say but in terms of cost it is going to cost you a bit more or a lot more than you using your poly mailer bags so we've understood that if we want to have luxury packaging it has to be a box guys i'm sorry it has to be a box but you have a choice of two types of boxes the rigid box which is a box like this mine is magnetic this box alone is going to set you back around about three dollars per box but you can also get a corrugated star box similar to that type of box i'm going to pop what it looks like on the screen I used to use this type of box for my clothing brand before I upgraded to this box and I used to get them from Box Mart. So I'm going to have Box Mart linked in the description and I'm also going to have the Alibaba supplier where I get these boxes from linked in the description as well. When you choose your box, ensure that the box is in the colour that your brand colours are in. With the rigid boxes, they come in a variety of colours but with the 
corrugated box it might be a little bit tricky so if you do find it tricky to find that box in the color that you want it to be in because it might come in a color like this like this brown color instead you can think about utilizing your brand colors in the additional things that you put in the box so like your tissue paper your stickers your thank you cards which we're going to discuss in a minute if you cannot find the box in your brand colors definitely ensure that everything else is in your brand colors so once you've decided whether you're going to go for a rigid box or a corrugated box we can start to look at the additional bits and bobs that we can add to increase the perceived value of our brand you know if we're going for luxury packaging it means that we have some sort of luxury brand now just to take it back a little bit in terms of levels to luxury the corrugated box comes under the rigid box so if you want to be the top of the top definitely look into getting that rigid box so next we are going to look at the extras the little bits and bobs that make your brand feel like it's a complete brand like a finished brand so the first thing i'm going to point your attention to is tissue paper so a lot of the time when we order from brands such as pretty little thing asos your garment is going to come in a polymailer and within that polymailer it's going to be in a plastic similar to how i store my garments in my office i store it in this like plastic to keep it from the dust and a lot of brands will send their garments in that plastic but an alternative that you can look at which is a better for the environment and b you can get it in your brand colors a lot more readily is wrapping this garment in tissue paper i don't know whether you'll be able to see at the back there that's where i keep my tissue paper and my tissue paper is in my brand color navy blue and it's a way of incorporating your brand colors giving a nod to sustainability protecting your garment and increasing your perceived value simply by using a little bit of tissue paper here in the uk i get my tissue paper from kite packaging really good value it's about 480 sheets for around about 30 pounds so the next thing you're going to want to think about are stickers so say if you are using tissue paper you are going to need something to secure that tissue paper together so it looks cute these are the stickers that i use as you can see again brand colors my brand colors are throughout everything to do with my brand because one thing about having brand colors and sticking to it is that it sets your brand apart from other brands it makes it recognizable it makes it look like you've actually put thought into your branding and you haven't just like thrown something out there and when i'm talking brand colors it's only when it comes to like your packaging and your website i'm not saying that all your garments need to be in navy blue and orange no it's just everything else that goes into your brand so stickers is another thing that's going to add that element of luxury and that touch of luxury to your packaging next we have to think about our thank you cards now i know a lot of brands high end and not tend to include a thank you card within their packaging but it's very important to ensure that your thank you card isn't too like colorful i've seen thank you cards that are just campaign pictures which is nice it's cute but it doesn't scream luxury in my opinion so when it comes to producing your thank you cards i want you to produce something that is clean and aesthetic even think about the texture of the paper that you're using so with my thank you cards they are very very simple and plain but i feel like they're very effective and they do the job so on one side i just have my emblem very small very cute and then on the other side that is where i have my message and the card that i use is like this textured card i believe they call it hammered it it almost looks like a wedding invitation it's just very classy i've used very descriptive wording when it comes to and um, what i've actually written on the thing thank you card so i'm using words like meticulously artisans like i really went to town when writing this card because i wanted it to scream luxury so definitely consider having a thank you card but make sure your thank you card is clean not too much going on and that will help your thank you card scream luxury now another thing that i do that i feel like screams luxury and that's just because when i have purchased from high-end brands they do this so so that's providing me with an invoice which is a 
again on a lovely bit of paper so i've incorporated that with my brand because i want my brand to be luxury right so i use again this stunning textured paper it's sort of like a linen and i print my custom invoices on that paper and then i pop that into that blue envelope that i showed you and then i pop my thank you card on top and that's basically how i present the box to my customers so when they open it up which is the first physical interaction they're gonna have with your brand they see in this envelope they're seeing this thank you card everything just looks in unison and it just looks good lastly you can think about incorporating things like ribbons so i put a nice little ribbon on my box again in my brand colors this you know serves two purposes it looks nice and it also keeps the box together so two reasons why i put ribbons on my boxes so that again is something that you can consider and of course having your logo on your packaging putting your logo where you can so i've got my logo on my box of course i've also got it up here on my thank you card and then i've got my emblem here which people don't really often see right there on my thank you card as well i have it on my stickers i would have had it on my tissue paper but we gotta save money where we can so i don't have it on my tissue paper but i do have it on my stickers so it works so those are my key luxury packaging ideas that you can take and implement when it comes to coming up with the packaging for your clothing brand. I am going to have as many links as I can in my description so that you can go ahead and start, you know, clicking, buying, seeing what you like, seeing what you can implement and all of that good stuff. And one little bit of advice that I can give you, that I will give you, is that if you find that, you know, you cannot find your box in the color that you want it to be, but you really want it to be in that color, definitely consider changing your brand colors. Ain't nothing wrong with that at all. I really really hope that you have found this video helpful please don't forget to like this video subscribe to my channel share it with your friends I will catch you guys in my very next video bye